we are hitting the road. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. It has rained here for three days, so Jay and I are looking forward to going out on the scooter today. We have no idea where we're gonna go, what we're gonna see, but we're gonna take you guys along. So before we go on any road trip, I always come and get some sort of snack, and my snack of choice, grape high chews. First things first, gasoline. <laughs> So this is what uh, Song Tao looks like in Chiang Mai. There are three different colors that I've seen so far. This white one, a red one, and yellow one. I have no idea what the colors mean. So we are just getting some gasoline filled up. Oh, we're already filled up. See? That quick. I don't even know how much it was. How much was it? 180. Woo! That's the highest we've ever uh, put in the scooter. You're down to two bars. Two bars. 180 baht. <laughs> Hitting the road. So we are going to hit some lunch and this place was recommended to us by a friend of ours, um, Rob Gordon. Hi Rob! And we have been here a couple of times already and loved the food so we are going to go back, get some lunch and then we're going to hit the road and see what we find. Okay, Jay, what are you getting? I'm getting a mango shake. And what else? Thai Thai Mama Noodle. Yummy. Chicken. Oh. Why are you drinking my shake? Hey, because it's good. Your, which one with your Coke Zero? Your mango shake is better. I can't wait to eat it. Look at all that chicken. was a lot of food. Oh, we're so stuffed. <laughs> uh, yes, but if you ever come to Chiang Mai, Cat's Kitchen is the place to go. It's inexpensive. My dish was 80 baht. Um, Jay got a mango smoothie. It was 45 baht, which is decent at a restaurant. And it's close to the Pi Gate, so very easy just to park at the Pi Gate and walk. So yes, highly recommend. We are hitting the road. This is like one of the touristy things to do here. Jay and I like to find things that um, aren't as touristy. I mean, we do go in uh, to things that are touristy. We've been to the Sticky Waterfalls. We've been to Doi Suthep. Um, but this is um, pretty interesting. It has tunnels underneath the pagoda outside. You don't typically see that in different temples that we have visited. So this is kind of unique. It's very cool in here, which is nice. I love all the brickwork in here too. It is um, pretty fascinating and all the little statues and they have like little cubbies down the hallways with little statues. It's pretty interesting.
note if you do come here. The grounds are very pretty and uh, majestic looking because it uh, has moss everywhere on all the bricks and stone, but it is very, very slippery. So keep that in mind if you're uh, coming here wearing some good shoes. <laughs> So that was Wat Yumong. Now we're off to go see another temple. So while we're sitting at the traffic light, this is your reminder to like and subscribe. And if you don't want to miss any of the videos that I post, hit the notification bell and that'll give you a notification. Thanks in advance. It really helps my channel and I appreciate it. We are at the Silver Temple and it's a man only temple. <laughs> so Jay is going to sneak in there and take some photos, but the outside is gorgeous. There is also a school on the grounds here and from what I understand all of these pieces are handmade um, so they're just kind of like punched into different designs. Absolutely stunning. feeling that these photos and video aren't going to do this place any justice. It's really sunny today so you kind of lose the detail in the sun. So we're going to try my best to um, give you an idea of just how beautiful this place is. temple. Where are we headed next? Stay tuned and find out. What's a one day tour without a waterfall? Stop at this viewpoint, it has an amazing view of the city. You can see that behind me right there. And then it has a waterfall. You can't get down to the base of the waterfall without being young and artistic. <laughs> I don't want to take the chance. So it's a fast flowing uh, waterfall. It sounds awesome. We got to this one little part, probably about midway up, um, that you could actually get down to it and look at it. Well, looks like we're gonna chance it. because we did it. sunglasses, on our phones, we didn't lose anything. Safe and sound. <laughs> Just our wind. Yeah. And we're off again. So we 
are gonna end the tour, the one day tour of Chiang Mai here. Um, we are at uh, Wat Doi Su Thep and uh, Jay and I have been here before so we won't show you around here. But today we didn't really know where we were gonna go. We got up, went Anywhere. to the gym. Yeah, we got up, went to the gym, hit the pool and then hopped on the scooter and this is what we did all day. So there's lots of things to do and see and lots of places to go. Just, it's been raining for the last three days, so we've been stuck in the apartment. Yes. Over the mall, so we just wanted to get away anywhere else. Yay! So, again, don't forget to like and subscribe, hit the notification bell, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, guys!